Welcome back to Wasteland 3, folks. We are looking for some dude with a key, and... Someone just said that they heard something to the left. Uh, let's take a look at this bulletin board. The board reads, Welcome to Ass Pen. <laughs> Alright, let's pick this lock. We approach the sturdy security door. You're, agreeing, you're greeted by an unknown uh, voice. Hey, y'all. I can hear you outside the door. Hello. My name's Ash. I guess I shouldn't tell you that. <laughs> Vic says you can't come in here. I don't care what Vic says. The security door on this door isn't that good, Ash. Well, boss, you ain't wrong. But that ain't what I meant. When I said you can't come in, I meant that I got a kill switch in here. Yeah, if you barge in, I gotta kill all the hostages. I'm, um... Sorry about that, but that's what Vic told me to do. Okay, you don't have to do this. You kill those hostages and you're a dead man. Uh, you kill those hostages and you're a dead man. Yeah, but I'm way more scared of Vic than I am of you. Afraid I don't have much choice. Okay, uh, see you. Off button, off button. Okay, let's have a quick look at this addendum. Um, mission log. Find and rescue the tor tortured hostages in Little Hell. The Psychopath, Vic Buchanan. Travel to Aspen, that's where I am. Alright. Alright, um, let's... Try and find another way in. Who sent you? Daddy? Or Libby? You can tell me. Don't be shy. Um, Jody, where are you? Let's start this fight with Jody. I want to take the bomb hopper out, I think. Come on back. Where'd they go? Come back here. There it is. All right. It's shocked. Okay. Come up here. Wow, you missed with everything. Good job, Quan. Seventy four percent to hit. Well, we did hit it. Uh, prepare. Lucia. Can you come up here? You missed. Again. Two misses. Great. Uh, Seuss. Eight percent hit chance. It's the same if I move up one. All right, that thing is dead. Good. Defend. Then we have Jody. I think I'll pull you back. Oh, that was Quan. Here. And then we'll move you up here. Just 
switch to that and ambush. In my field of fire. All right. Right, the bear needs some healing. Uh, Zeus, actually, you see ya. If you move out here, then you're out of the poison, right? Yeah. Hawk. Oh, it's so close to dead, man. Alright, move out of the poison. Sallow, come out of the poison. Need to take out that bomb hopper before it blows. You see ya? Ha! Ah! Come on! Three misses. Fantastic. Uh, actually, cancel because I want people to move away first. Zeus, come back here. All right. Jesus. CPU. Alright. I killed that. That thing is... That was awesome! Alright. Uh, you... We only have two antidote left. Let's give it to the cub, because the cub is... hurt quite bad. Uh, how long is there left? 66 seconds. Alright, I guess we'll have to just heal them when they're done taking damage. Alright. Looks like they never had a care in the world, huh? Okay. Ooh. It's a portrait. Picture of the gift. Mission critical item. A picture shows a mother in a yellow dress with her three daughters. Okay. We found a picture of a middle-aged woman with three young girls, possibly her daughters. The picture does not look old enough to be pre-war, but it is covered in a layer of dust as if no one has looked at it in years. The women all seem content and healthy. They must have been fairly well off. The gift, a humor, Giuseppe, a breather, a crazer, a breather, a breather. Alright, I'm gonna pull back a bit, then I am going to have you heal Quan, heal Salo, mm. we wanna heal Jody, I guess so. Alright, now Giuseppe is one of ours. 
Then there's the gift that we can talk to a fumer, a breather, crazy, well, Dr. Hyde. Okay, let's do a quick save. The gift. The woman in the heavy wheelchair looks at you, then looks at the green-skinned woman in a ranger uniform beside her. Her guards glare at you, but are clearly awaiting her, awaiting her signal. Look like you. Sound like you. Do you know them? Yes, Gift. I know them. They don't want to hurt anyone. They want to help. Uh, Persephone's eyes are focused on you, and she smiles. Stay calm. Is that so? So, Rangers, you've killed many of my breathers on your way here. You want to help? Let's start by ending the killing, then. Okay. The breathers attacked us. Uh, Ranger, are you all right? You care for your tribe. Good. We have this in common, as I care for mine. But understand, my breathers don't live in the same reality you do. They move in and out of the dream under Victory's guidance. And Victory guided them to fight off intruders. Okay. So, introductions. I am the gift. I make the gases that enable my breathers to live in the dream. But it was Victory that first showed us the dream. It is his guidance that shows us the path through it. But I do not approve of all this... Killing, why bring death into the dream? And not all you outsiders are that bad. Pazepi here has been a real help. So, let's talk, yes? Okay. Uh, we're here to deal with the Patriarch's son way, one way or another. You have one of our people. We're taking her back. We don't know enough yet to trust you, but we can talk. We don't know enough yet to trust you, but we can talk. There's wisdom in seeking knowledge. Let's talk more, then. Your friend will stay with us, to ensure everyone stays on their best behavior. So, you must have questions. As she awaits your questions, you realize something. The gift is wearing the dress of the woman in the picture you found in the memorial hall. We don't need to talk about Victory Buchanan. Show family picture. Is this you? Mechanics, your chair is impressive. Is it powered? Why is Pisepi here? Can we ask you something about the breathers? Attack. Um, I'm going to show the family picture. Yes, it is. My mother. My sister. Me. This was before. Don't remember this place. Too long ago. But this was her home. The girl I was. The girl that broke. The girl Victory healed. Uh, Vic healed you? Yes. I mean, I don't remember. I woke up broken. Victory was there. He greeted me with a smile and a hug. Found me and fixed me. Pretty sure that Vic is probably who did that I to you. I am the gift because of what I bring into the world. Access to the dream. Victory showed me this. He showed us all. Okay. Need to talk about Victory Buchanan. Uh, Victory is a psychopath. He wasn't the one who saved you. He broke you. Uh, mechanics. Your chair is impressive. Is it powered? I'm going to say Perception 8. Uh, Victory is a psychopath. He wasn't the one who saved you. He broke you. I don't believe that. You think you know Victory, but you don't. This killing, it's not all of who he is. He gifted us the dream. He made the breathers. What are these people, if not all saved by victory, guided by his hand, guided to help him? Okay. 
Uh, your character chair is impressive. Is it powered? Uh, mm, yeah, let's do uh, the chair. Yes. Victory Buchanan gave it to me. Strong. Reliable. It lets me move. Broken as I am. Okay. Can we take a closer look at the chair? Once. Yes. Okay. Explosives 8. You examine the chair, instinct tickling the back of your mind. The overly powerful battery is one clue. You kneel down for a closer look. Tucked beneath the gift seat is a nest of innocent wires. Uh, is a small black rectangle that is almost certainly a bomb. Uh, you have a bomb beneath your chair. Let us disarm it. Uh, you have a bomb beneath your chair. Let us disarm it. Disable and remove the device from, the, from beneath the chair. The gift reaches out and takes the bomb from you. Would have killed me. Others. Another of Victory's small jokes. She chucks the device away in her chair. Uh, can we ask you something about the breeders? Your curiosity speaks well of you. Ask. Uh, your breeders seem pretty violent. How does Victory guide the breeders? Are you breathing the same gas as the breeders? Uh... Are you breathing the same gas as the breathers? This? No. I need to remain in reality to guide others into the dream. This. This is for the pain. Okay. Uh, you're. How does Victory guide the breathers? Suggestion. My breathers are not entirely here. They see the world differently. Victory understands as he's seen the same world. So he can suggest truths they would otherwise not see. Okay, your breathers seem pretty violent. Distressing. There is no violence in the dream. But when they're in there, they're pliable, suggestible like children. I have always trusted Victory to guide them well. Mm-hmm. Never mind, let's talk yes, about something else. Let's. Uh, why is Pisepi here? Victory took your ranger friends. Beat and humiliated. I assessed them. Saw her. Saw... intelligence. Knowledge, both rare, convinced victory to give her to me. Okay, now that we're here, can you let her go free? We're grateful that you protected her. This doesn't have to end in violence if you hand her over now. Uh, we're grateful that you protected Gratitude. her. A rare thing. Thank you. Victory will kill you. Can't be helped. But not her. She is brilliant. A treasure. A gift. Okay. We need to talk about Victory Buchanan. Talk then. Listen to us. Vic doesn't care about anyone but himself and is just using you. Let us take care of him and you'll be safe. You know we mean you no harm. Let us take care of Victory and we will let you be. Alright, kiss ass. Let's do kiss ass. She stutters you in silence. A minute passes. Finally, she looks away. I know, I know. Deal with him as you like. We will not interfere. The breathers will travel their own path now. Without victory. Nice. Her eyes turn from you to Pisepi. Go if you want. Can still use you. But go if you want. Thank okay. you, Gift. Rangers, let's talk. Outside. But okay. Warned, other than my guards, the breathers inside this lodge are too far gone into the dream for me to reach. Avoid them if you can. Kill them if you must. Okay. All right. Goodbye. Okay. So we need to talk to Pisepi. Where is she? Uh, where she go? She's there. All right, but I want to. First of all, I want to do a quick save. 
and then I want to check this stuff around here. Let's take a look, see if they complain about that. Nope. All right. Let's check that one. Must be where they mix the medicine. All right, and then there's the doctor in here. And there's a container. Don't touch that. Okay. Uh, Dr. Hyde. Three walkers. The gift has said to heal you. Okay, let's trade. Uh, the merchant. Uh, let's see. We want consumables. I want some antidote. Let's buy 14 of them. I want some injury kits. I want all of them. Uh... Let's buy some of these. Just buy ten. And let's buy some of these. So buy ten of those as well. All right. Okay. What else did he add? He had some ammo. Let's take a look at ammo. We have. We could use some fifty cal ammo. Let's buy a hundred of it. Other than that, I think we're good. Alright. Let's talk to Pesepi. Oh my goodness! Rangers! We thought we were the only ones who survived the ambush on the lake. Pesepi! You're here! Jody! You survived! I am so glad to see you. Okay, you don't seem to get along with the gift. Or you seem to get along with the gift. Didn't leave when the gift said you could go. You could go. You seem to get along with the gift. We have common interests. At first, I thought she was going to cut me open. But after they gassed me to keep me compliant and it didn't work, we talked about chemistry all night. It was practically a slumber party. Okay. You didn't leave when the gift said you could go? Well, you know... It's hard to leave anywhere once you get comfortable, so to speak. I've been trying to figure out where La Loca and Rook were taken. They're the others from my team, but you probably know that. Maybe you can help them? Let's not forget about Woodson. Have you found him yet? They made him work on the radio. Uh, yes, he's safe. He's okay, but they're in pretty bad enough about your team. Tell us what you, you can about what's going on here. All right, yes, he's safe Good. for now. Good. We need to finish this. Yes, we do. Vic is in the Patriarch's wing, the fancy one. The prisoners are all well, somewhere else. I don't know. I heard a guard talking about chemical testing being done on a man in the sauna. There were five hostages left, apart from Woodson and me. I was separated from them when the gift requested that I remain by her side. Okay, a guy named Ash told us he has a kill switch for the hostages. One thing I've learned here? <laughs> it's not safe to assume that anyone is bluffing about how crazy they are. Make sure you save anyone you can before going after him again. Okay. The other two hostages were women, and they were part of the hundred families. I'm not sure where they were taken. Okay, what are you going to do now? Not sure what's next, to be honest. But thank you so much for getting the gift to free me. Truth You're welcome. Told, what I need right now is a breather. This place really was hell, and I need to gather my wits. But I'll be rooting for you, and let's talk once you're done here, yeah? Sure. Now, where did I put the rest of my stuff? There was something moving up here. Let's quick save. Don't see anything. Well, 
There's something there. I'm gonna quick save again. Whoa. We're in it now. Oh, it's a gas hopper. Okay. Um. Where's Lucia? Oh. Right. Uh, Quan. Oh, there's shit. There's another one. Uh, come on, come back here. Well, it's good we bought some antidote. Dead, isn't it? And then more. Oh, it's there. Uh. All right, uh, you. Uh, let's get your antidote down there. And let's use it. Jody. Growler Cub. Lucia. And Quan. All right. Now, I want to save this. You shouldn't be coming after me, strangers. My father's the real monster. Him and Libby. At least see. I'm wrong in the obvious places. You can trust my kind of crazy. Mm -hmm. Dead, bitch. Just wait until I get out of here. Wait! Fuck you. I'm gonna cut. Okay, La Loca. Alright, we have three. Two breather. Well, a breather. Gertrude the Gruesome. And a Fraser. Alright. So we will take them out in the next one, guys, because we are out of time. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.